So I, I thought my, the first thing I self-published, which is 11 years ago now, was my per, first poetry map, Amniotic City. Um, and um, it's a walkable map of a tiny bit of the city of London around St. Paul's Cathedral. It folds up into an A6. I'm not going to try and do that now. Um, and it's got photos on one side, which have a pin, and they follow onto the poems, so you can walk where the poems are. And I, I did this at the end of my degree 11 years ago, and um, I've got, I'm now working on a second edition. So I wanted to read a couple of these poems, because I haven't read them for a really long time, and um, yeah. Um, so uh, that's what I'm going to do. Uh, the Impossible Circle Squared Mile. Underneath here lies the stomach of the goddess, digesting corruption, concrete, and loath's shoes, like any mother alchemist, unconditionally loving her wrecking ball child of this gold into shit square off the peg mile. A round, transcendental hole, excreting wisdom, drip feeding the unstable spirit of this city. This much squareness is impossible. Um, and this next one is Drift with Buggy, and this is a record of the last time um, I took the buggy out with my son in it. Um, and that's, that was the 1st of April 2011. The buggy is about to become redundant. Its final spin on All Fool's Day this year is revolutionary. We celebrate Hilaria, Without knowing, Sibeli leads us a merry dance. Mother and son, adventure begins with pop-up crash art action at Tate Modern. I show you the Millennium Bridge. Shall we walk across it? You set precedent and run ahead. We reach, we reach Carter Lane, and I walk this concrete, liquid landscape here now as a mother, with you and a buggy. You think Carter Court is boring and dark, how Taurian, I say, tongue firmly in cheek. Descending Ludgate Hill, you, me, and the buggy, past St Bride's Church, towards the temple where we play football, drift down to embankment, temple gardens, zag across the Thames to watch skateboarders Ollie at the National Theatre, the thwarted escape of your balloon, captured by a tree on the south bank, Waterloo and a train away. Today the past is vanquished, I left a band of gold in one city and discovered the mother load was waiting here all the time in the smoke. And just one more. This is called Feed the Birds. What if, I imagine, as I walk the perimeter, this was a temple to Diana now, with its anatomy of a mother. Later, as I eat lunch with my friend, we talk about it and decide Christopher Wren was seduced by the auric female form on Ludgate Hill. The waitress tells us that the seeds of its preservation are kept in the golden acorn crowning the column in Paternoster Square. Thank you.